Ever since I was a young kid, I usually consumed my music through the diaphragms of a headphone. In the 1980s and 90s, over-ear headphones were the most popular. In the early 2000s, everyone started switching to earbuds. When phones began to replace the iPod, Walkman, and portable CD players offering a mic feature to speak hands-free with your phone. In the roaring 20s now, many companies are starting to adopt true wireless earphones. These little guys are packed with technology, including a microphone to communicate via Bluetooth on phone calls or Zoom meetings. Uh, Kef is a very well-known company throughout the audio world. They have recently released the Mu3, a pair of true wireless earphones with noise-canceling technology. Let's find out more about them and how they can benefit you and your everyday life. The first true wireless earphones were made by Onkyo, of all people, in 2015. They called it the Onkyo W800BT. Onkyo laid down a standard and pioneered a product that most consumers would soon adopt for its overall convenience. I think everyone wanted to get rid of that annoying cord attached to their mobile phones or any other listening device for that matter. Bluetooth provided this innovative and new way to communicate and consume content which I thought was pretty cool. One step forward. The Onkyo W800BT did face some issues with its Bluetooth connectivity, short battery life, and complaints from users about poor sound quality. Others even felt that they were causing discomfort compared to their wired counterparts. Even though they had issues, being the first of their kind and all, you know, it paved the way for other companies, especially Apple who loves to command the trends in technology to create its own take on the newfound technology. People were excited. The hype was intense. And unless they discover a way to literally beam the sound into our minds, I think this might be the standard for years to come, really. The Kef Mu 3s are the company's only pair of earphones, coming in at a reasonable $229 at this moment in time, Pricing often changes in this industry, so don't hold me to it, but right now they're $229. I feel like most of these earphones range from like the $120-ish up to upwards of about $500. Bucks. That's, that's where they kind of, that's where they live. Kef has a reputation for making an excellent looking product, and the Mu 3s are no exception. They were designed by Ross Lovegrove, who designed Kef's ultra high-end Muon speak, Muon loudspeakers. I think I'm saying that right. Uh, he even signed the inside of the charging case so you won't forget who designed them. I really like the magnetic grip that the charging case provides so they sit securely while they, while they charge. I know magnetism isn't anything cutting edge, but sometimes small details matter the most to some of us. It does to me. They're rated at nine hours of listening time. I listen to them for, I don't know, about a week now and haven't needed a charge. I can't tell you exactly how long to the second, but it's several hours while working on some projects at my desk and they're still going strong, you know? They are available in silver gray and this is charcoal gray. Uh, choices, people, choices. I honestly like them in both colors. I can't decide. In the comments below, tell me which one you think looks better, the, the silver gray or the charcoal gray. The charging case itself is very cool. It has a smooth rounded curves around the case. I don't know if any of you ever watched the flight of the navigator, but it kind of reminds me of that spaceship in the movie before, you know, before it got pointy and went crazy. That's what it, that's what it reminds me of. I don't know. Brain dropping. Anyways, moving on to the overall setup, I pushed the circular buttons on the outside of the earphones to turn them on. They kicked on into pairing mode. I activated the Bluetooth on my phone and within seconds, I was listening to, you know, my favorite tunes. Um, and the button is just, it's a huge button right there with a little groove, so it's comfy. Kev claims that they have exceptional noise cancellation. You can actually cycle through three different types of noise cancellation by pressing the left ear button. They also have an ambient mode if you want to be more aware of your surroundings. The noise cancellation worked well. You know, I, I couldn't hear the keystrokes as I was, you know, typing on my computer and my keyboard is pretty loud. It has, you know, those tactile buttons. I couldn't hear the annoyance of the street outside and it's fairly busy street. So you got ambulances and, you know, crazy stuff out there. As I cycled through the different noise isolation options, I didn't really notice a huge 
audible difference between them. However, I'm not sure what I was really looking for. After all, I was trying to listen to music while listening to the absence of sound. So I don't know. I think it works just fine. It's not a feature that has ever enticed me. I've never owned noise canceling headphones because I, you know, I don't go on airplanes or anything. However, it may be necessary to you. If it is, knowing your heart, they do a great job tuning out the outside world. So this is a total win for you introverts. The right ear answers calls and can play and pause your tunes. Simply push the button. Simple. No need to overcomplicate these controls. And Kef did a great job keeping it simple and easy to use. I also called my mom to see how the voice quality and microphone worked. Overall, the conversation went great. Mom is doing really good. Uh, she actually watches my videos, not knowing a lick of what I'm talking about. But mom, I appreciate the support and I love you very much. I actually do miss my mom a lot during the holidays, so I hope this makes her day, because she's gonna be watching this right before Christmas. The sound quality in both directions was great. So during the conversation, no, no issues. The standard for these types of devices, I would think, is is about right. I, you know, I don't really think the call quality really sways one way or another too far for these kinds of earphones. Um, but I did put it through the gauntlet and listen to most of my Quobuz playlist, including rock, hip hop, EDM, did it all. So how did it sound? Well, I think they're really well balanced. I don't feel like they leaned too hard in any sonic direction. Uh, more neutral than anything, really. The bass was present, the mids were pronounced, and the highs provided a lot of detail. Overall, it was a pleasant experience. Could they have used a, you know, a bit more bass? I, I would say yeah. I suppose that that would be my only opportunity for these for the next generation. Bassier. Give me more bass. However, these earphones give you everything you want. Clarity, simplicity, outstanding performance, and a very stylish finish. And I feel that they are priced correctly for what they provide. So who are these really for? Anyone in the market for high quality, well-built, carefully designed, noise canceling, true wireless earbuds with a compact form factor. So basically everyone, I suppose. Uh, they are comfortable even after extended use. I, they were on there for hours. People who care about sound quality should enjoy the neutrality of the sound signature. And people who love going to the gym, for example, the gym, good example, can rest easy. Thanks to its splash-proof IPX5 rating, these are perfect gym earphones, to be honest. They will drown out the ambiance of the gym. You might, you know, not hear the clanking of the weights, the unnecessary grunts. And if you sweat on them a little bit, you'll be okay. <laughs> but uh, in all seriousness, I really enjoyed the Mu 3s, and my ears are very peculiar. Not many earphones fit nicely in my weird ear holes. These, com these definitely comfortably hug my ear really well. Great ergonomic design. Overall, I think these are a win. Uh, I'll leave a link below if you'd like to check them out. Uh, thank you all for joining me today. If you are on Facebook, check out Hi-Fi Audio Addiction. It's my private group there, and I would love to have you there. If you want to buy a VU Meter shirt, the link will be in the description below. Uh, I do have to say I have the coolest and as far as I know the most extensive selection of audiophile approved t-shirts and hoodies. So check it out. Thank you again for your time guys and definitely enjoy the holidays and have a Merry Christmas. Take care.